Yo, what's good guys? Welcome back to another World of Warcraft Classic video. Welcome back to the channel. I missed you guys. Uh, I'm back here again though, playing more World of Warcraft. Uh, I just literally, I literally just woke up like 20 minutes ago. So like if I'm like a drowsy or if I'm not making any sense, Excuse me for that. But yeah, guys, we're playing more World of Warcraft Classic on our Orc Shaman. Hello, B. In the last video, we did a bunch of quests in the Bone Waste. It was a great time. I had a great time playing um, World of Warcraft that day. It was fun. It was very fun. And um, let's just uh, let's just get right down to it. Let's just start uh, questing. We are at Stonebreaker Hold right now. Um, uh, you guys are probably like, wait, why are you here? I thought you were in the Bone Waste. Well, I'm here because I have to turn in this one quest, the Wanted Poster quest. And this will hopefully give us the level up um, so we can hit level 64. That will be pretty sweet, guys. So let's go ahead and do that. So we got to talk to... Excuse me, Mog Grimshot. I was about to yawn, but I don't know, something, something didn't happen. What the? I thought he was shooting this guy. I was like, yo, chill. Yo, chill. Yo, thrall looking ass. Go back to Ogremar. That ass. Alright. Uh, enough roasting. Uh, the horde people. Let's go talk to Mog. Bone Lashers, I hate them all. If it weren't for the loss of my eye and the fainting spells that I get sometimes, I'd be out there shooting them down all the time. You must have killed a lot of those uh, Bone Lashers. <sighs> oh, God, excuse me. Good, I hate them. Ever since I was bit by one of them, I keep having fainting spells. Do you realize how embarrassing that is? Here, take this as a thanks for exacting some revenge for me. Alright, he gives us some gold. I wish I was some items, Mr. Mog, but you know what? It's fine. Just give me your gold. Oh, and he gives us another quest. God dang it, and we didn't level up. Wow. We were so close, guys. Alright, Torgos. I want Torgos. King of the Bone Lashers dead. Not long ago, while I was out hunting at Vale Rays on the western edge of the waste, he fell upon me. Mog taps his eye patch. He took my eye, and now I would have his life. Bring me one of his tall feathers as proof, and I'll give you a worthy reward. You'll need his mate, Tracula's carcass, though, to call him down as he's deathly afraid of the old Arakone Scarecrow, known as Torgos' Bane. Find her at Cenarian, uh, Carrion Hill in the Northern Wastes. Call down Torgos with Tracula's carcass, acquire a tail feather of Torgos and return it to Maul Grimshot. Add Stonebreaker Hold in Terracar 4, suggested players 2. Oh. Trinkets? Bro. Yeah, we're accepting this. Oh, we have someone looking for a group for Alkanai Crips, but he's looking for a tank. Oh, I'm about to Google and see what level the uh, dungeons are in the Terracar Forest, because if someone's doing a recruiting and they need a DPS, I might take it if we could do it in this video. So it's around level 64 to 67, but I mean, we could probably go in at level 63. That's for the Alcanite Crypts, by the way. I don't know if I said that. Uh, I'm gonna look up all Terracar Forest Dungeons. Oh, wow, it's so, this is so much easier to read. So we have Mana Tomb, 64 66, Alcanite Crypts, 65 to 67. Set that calls, 67 to 69, Shadow Labyrinth. Yeesh, it says approximate runtime for each of these is like an hour and a half to three hours. What the fuck? So we're definitely going to need to do that on a day where we don't have to go to work. Because as per usual, guys, I have to go to work at 4 p.m. 
Ah, <sighs> lay sigh. Lay freaking sigh. Oh, wow, that looks pretty cool. Is there a way to get to the Stonebreaker hole? Oh, oh my god, there is, right here. I was about to say, is there a way to get to the Stonebreaker hole through the bone waste? And, oh, wow. Oh, oh god. Uh, sorry. Alas, we have found it, my friends. Alright, you know what? So we gotta, um... So we got a quest here to kill some giant bird guy. Um, I guess we could try to do it because maybe uh, it's possible. This one says suggested players three. So sheesh. I don't know if we could be able to... I don't know if we're able to do that. Oh, I forgot to check my mail too. I guess we could check it at the end of the video. Whatever. Alright, what am I doing? Um, Drape of Anka who? Oh, here we go. Ethereal Nethermancer. An Ethereal Plunderer. Wow, these are actually the two guys that we have to kill. Alright, so let's just uh, let's just get right down to business. That was some perfect timing there. Right when I had no idea what I was supposed to be doing, I figured out what we were supposed to be doing. Awesome. Alright, so we're gonna do this first quest here called the Tomb of Lights, where we have to kill some Ethereal Nethermancers and Ethereal Plunderers. And these are those guys right here. So we're gonna go do that. Uh, the Shadow Tomb? What is the Shadow Tomb? We could probably do the Shadow Tomb next. West of the Refugee Caravan and Retrieve the Drape of Arunan? Hmm. West of the North, East, Southwest. Okay. I remember in one of my videos, I could not tell direction for some reason. I thought East was West, so I was looking on like the West side. When I was supposed to be looking on the east side. It's one of my Zanger Marsh videos. So I thought the east side was the west side for some reason. I don't I don't ask me why. Oh my god, yo chill, there's another guy ganking me. Yo chill, homie. But yeah, I, I made a fool out of myself. You guys can watch that. Um it is one of my Zang Yo chill. Why are these guys getting so close to me, bro? What in the god's name, bro? Thankfully, we have 11 health potions, but like, god damn, bro. Can you chill? I'm just trying to have a chillax day, but these guys freaking... These guys don't want to let me have that. It's like, damn, bro. Like, just relax. It's not that serious, Mr. Plunder. Right. Freaking A, man. Yeah, these guys are ganking me. I'm trying to freaking talking-ish. Like, oh my gosh. Talking shit. Now I just forgot what I was talking about. God damn. Alright, but anyways guys, I forgot what I was talking about, who cares, uh, oh wait, yeah, um, if you guys wanna see me make, um, be, if you guys wanna see me be dumb, go watch my previous videos, um, I do, do a lot of dumb things, um, and yeah, and I also forgot to mention in the beginning of this video, to like, comment, and subscribe, that would be very awesome. So yeah, like, comment, subscribe, like, comment, and subscribe, like, comment, subscribe, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And, um, I guess you guys can comment, you know, letting me know. Oh, what the? I guess you guys can comment down, letting me know if you guys have been enjoying the videos or not, you know. Uh, it seems like a lot of you, it seems like a good amount of you are enjoying the videos, which makes me very happy. Alright. I am very happy, okay? It doesn't sound like it, but I am. Oh yeah, look at this big dragon, guys. Terabus is the cursed. That's pretty neat, right? Looks pretty neat. These guys need to freaking come up with a better outfit. Alright. Looking like something from a freaking 90s Halloween costume. Wrapping the toilet paper all over your dang self. Like a fool. Alright, enough roasting this guy. I'm I'm sorry. It's it's not like me to do this. Okay, maybe it is a little bit. I do enjoy roasting people. I think it's funny. I think it's fun. I think it's fun. Alright, but sometimes I do go a little bit too overboard. 
What the hell is this? It's like a little... Oh, there's someone... Oh, that's where that, uh... That's where that torrent and that blood elf came out of. I was like... Yeah, where did those guys come from? But... Looks like they're... They came from there. The Tomb of Lights? Do we have to do anything in the Tomb of Lights? I don't know. Let's, let's check our quest. Um... Veil... Lithic? No. Tomb of Lights! Oh, well, we are doing the quest in Tomb of Lights. Oh, no. oh, the Tomb of Lights! Oh, okay, okay, we have to go here. Okay, we have to go here. This is the thing that requires three people to do. So, um, we might get owned. Whoa, who is this guy? Ethereal Arcanist, Ethereal Nethermancer. Yo. These guys are looking menacing F. What is this? Plunder, just a bunch of plunders. Got a bunch of pirate boys. Right, oh my god, we're about to level up, guys. Uh, I think we need like maybe like two more monsters and we can level up. Oh my gosh, let's freaking go, dudes. Let's freaking go. It's probably gonna help us, uh, maybe do this quest. I'm gonna just attempt it, cause you know what, fuck it, right? Like, who cares? You know, I, I wanna at least try it, you know? Oh, we leveled up too, nice guys. But yeah, I wanna at least try it. After landing a critical strike with your frost, or fire frost or nature spell damage, you enter clear casting state. The clear casting state reduces the mana cost of your next two damage spells by 40%. Don't we already have something like this? What is it called? Shamanistic Focus? After landing a melee critical strike, you enter the focus state. The focus state reduces the mana cost of your next shock spell by 60%. 60% and 40%. Probably... I don't like that. That thing sucks, right? Like, we literally already have something like this. We don't need another one, right? Unless they, unless they stack. I'm gonna hold up. Uh... Reduce the cooldown or cooldown of the shock spells. Like, is that even decent? I guess I would want like defenses then, right? Because I mean, what is this? Increase the critical strength, critical strike chance of your lightning bolt and chain lightning spells. Like, no, I don't. I don't even want that. Like, that, that thing isn't really good for us. Uh, I'm gonna hold off for now until we can find like a guide on uh, the old Google to help us out there. Uh, because currently I don't know what I'm doing. I should put my skill point in, but I must- I don't like this thing. This it, elemental focus, it doesn't seem like it's good. We already have a clear casting effect. Is, why, I don't, why would we need two, you know? So, so we got uh, a bunch of plunderers here, so I'm just gonna farm them and we should be finished the quest. Or finished half of the quest at least. We need to find nethermancers. Can you die? Can my regular auto attacks kill you? Okay, nice, it did, but very slowly. Very slowly. I mean, I guess we could put like the points into the lightning bolt thing, but I, I don't really be like using lightning bolt like that, you know? I do not be using lightning bolt like that. Alright, Mr. Plunder, it's time to go back into the toilet where you belong, you freaking toilet paper monster. Alright, uh, wait, what am I supposed to do? Summon a Draenei Tome Guardian in the depths of the Tomb of Lights. Wait, am I reading this? Uh, Test a Tome Tomb. Oh my gosh. Why are there like so many different ways to pronounce freaking words in English? Like, come on, bro. Like, what the hell? Why are they getting so complicated? Alright. Uh, okay, we killed all the plunderers. I'm pretty sure... We don't have to fight this guy, but I'm just gonna fight him because, I mean, he's in like some sort of room. I mean, what, what, what is this? Oh, she's like, oh, it's just like literally just like a tiny little room. I thought there was maybe gonna be something inside of it, but nah, there wasn't. 
All right, do we have any buffs, though? I don't know if we have any buffs. You know, I'm gonna see what this, um... I'm gonna see what this battered steam tongue controller does. What does this do? Fires a cannon. Oh, what the fuck? Wait, what? Wait, what? Man, that thing, use that thing is useless, bro. Whatever. I don't even know what this thing does. It's just like, if we go too far, it just like dies. Which... I mean, it kinda sucks. Uh, oh, that guy left! Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so we can, we can actually, uh... Cheese this fight a little bit. I think these guys are casters though, so we might have to uh, be a little careful, do this with a little bit of strategy. Have a little bit of strategy involved in fighting these guys, you know. Uh, yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do. So what we're gonna do here is I'm gonna full heal. Uh, summon some totems here. Yes, indeedy duty. And uh oh, he's back. Um, you know what? Uh, YOLO, right guys? Just YOLO. Why not? Screw it. Yeah, these guys are casters. Okay, this guy isn't a caster. We can fight him. What is this? Arcane damage does increase by... Okay, he's dead. Okay, we gotta interrupt this. Okay. We're doing things. We're doing it, guys. Okay, not bad, not bad. Shadow Bolt for 540 damage. That's what he did against me. That's a uh, that, that kind of hurts. Okay, okay, that wasn't bad, guys. We actually cleared out all three of them without. Well, we used our shamanistic rage, so we actually did pop our cooldowns. Uh, we might have been able to do it without the rage. I don't know because we didn't do it with the, without the rage. But um, yeah, that wasn't that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. Alright, so what we, what we have to do here, guys, is we gotta go deep into the Tomb of the Lights. Uh, and then we have to... Uh, I'm gonna just gonna read, I'm just gonna read this. So, High Priest Orglum wants you to journey into the Tomb of Lights and use the Draenei to, uh, to, Tomb Relic near the ancient Draenei Altar. Defend the Tomb Guardian and defeat the Vengeful Harbinger. When the ritual is complete, speak with Draenei Ascendant at the, Dra uh, at the ancient Draenei Altar. Uh, okay. And we get a trinket from this, so this is what I really was wanting. The trinkets. So we get two trinkets, which is going to be so good, bro. Because these trinkets that we have are some doo-doo. I accidentally sold one of my old trinkets for this freaking Argent Dawn doo-doo freaking trinket. Man, I freaking got skimazed. I freaking baited. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. I don't want you to hit my uh, Searing Totem. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, okay, actually. It worked out. I pressed my Earth Shock, and I thought it missed his Shadow Bolt, but it actually ended up interrupting it. So, hey, man. Even better for me. Okay, who is this guy? We got Nethermancer. We do need to fight some Nethermancers. We need to kill uh, three more. We got one right here. I'm just gonna go ahead and just fight you. Bring them booty chiefs here, boy. Okay, let's bring him over to our totems, you know. Help us out, help us fight this guy. Ooh. Slave hander, slave handler, pants of the sorcerer. I guess. Alright, let's heal up. And I believe uh, the drain eye altar should be over here. Oh shit, what the? Yeah, yeah, right. Oh, wait. Is it, is it, is it? I see it? I, I don't know. We just gotta explore it though and see. I'm assuming it's there. I mean, we're in the Tomb of Lights, so I mean, where else would it be, right? Where else would it be? Under the sea, part of your world. I think I just sang like three different Disney songs in one song. I don't even know. I don't even know what's happening. Where's the Drain Eye Altar? I'm kind of scared, guys. I'm kind of scared. Did the quest... The quest did... The quest turned yellow, though. So I guess that's a good sign. 
And that talent point really isn't gonna like do anything for us here. So I mean, it's fine. I don't even need to put that talent point in. I mean, dude, I go, why am I taking these things? These things stink, bro. Is there anything here that's good here? We have improved lightning shields, increase the chance to block attacks with a shield. Man, what the? Are you kidding me? Toughness, though, not bad. This will help us be a lot tankier, which we definitely need. Because, I mean, we're a melee class, right, guys? So it's like we need to like be tanky, you know? At least somewhat tanky. So we're going to be we to take the fight to them. And all that stuff. We're gonna be taking a lot of damage. We don't have range on our side. So I might... I'm honestly thinking of just going for toughness here and just saying screw it. And we also reduce the duration of movement slowing effects by 10% at level 1. So I mean, that's pretty good. <coughs> Excuse me. Where is this altar? Like, is it- is that it? Like, this thing I'm hovering over? I don't even know. Is that- I, I don't know. Uh, we got these Arcanist guys here. These guys look pretty neat. These guys weren't that strong when I fought them at the- earlier. They kinda got bursted down pretty fast. Yeah, literally, uh, my com- when I unleashed my combo on him, he's pretty much at like 40% life after it, so I mean, damn, that's pretty good. That is pretty good. So yeah, a storm strike. Oh shit, yo, what the? Yo, chill, homie. Man, I gotta purge your ass. Oh shit. Okay, you know what? Maybe I am underestimating this guy. His spells uh, kind of hurt me. They kind of hurt me. I gotta interrupt that noise, because screw that. I do not want to deal with this. Man, is this guy making noises? Like, this guy sounds like a dinosaur, bro. Like, what the hell? Come on, man. What are these guys doing here? Like, are these guys okay? This guy's hitting a- this guy's smacking a freaking a wall or something. I don't even know. I don't even want to know what he's doing. Yeesh. Okay. Uh, let me put these new bandages... ...on... ...my action bars. Where is the- is this the Drain Eye Altar? I'm, I'm assuming it's the Drain Eye Altar, right? I'm assuming. We gotta do this quick. We got to do this quick. Uh, actually, I'm not gonna take the 2v1 because uh, this guy's spell damage kind of hurts. Not gonna lie. Let me uh, make sure we purge that spell damage buff that he got off. Okay, let's do this quick. We gotta do this quick. I'm just going straight to the next guy. Straight to the next guy. So what, let's read the quest, guys. Um, Vengeful Harbinger. Uh, what is it? Defend the Tomb Guardian. So we have to defend someone called a Tomb Guardian. Oh my god, that guy hurts. Yeah, um, this might be a little rough for us because we don't have any, like, we don't have any buffs on us. We don't have any scrolls or nothing, so oof. Hopefully that Defender guy, uh, helps us fight. So yeah, summon a Draenei Tomb Guardian in the depths of the Tomb of Light, so I'm hoping that this guy can like maybe tank for us maybe we need to get i need to be made i need to be increasing my cooking skills because we really need to get like those well-fed buffs and shit oh here we go man this guy ain't man this guy even attack this guy is definitely not attacking nobody it's a freaking like spirit guy oh shit all right well we did it guys uh something's definitely about to happen when he reach once he reaches the top yep he's getting sucked off by some lightning it looks like we don't really have a companion here to help us do the quest which makes me kind of sad because that just means it's going to be a lot harder we might die here guys we definitely might die here so you know i'm kind of scared what, what's going on what is he doing he's scaring me Oh, oh yes, there we go. We got a, we got a homie. Uh, hopefully he attacks, and hopefully there, these monsters aren't very difficult. Who the heck is that? You guys see that? What is this? 
Oh, it's a drain eye, drain eye ghost. What the hell? Yo, chill. Oh shit, these guys are walking menacingly towards us. Okay, he's doing his thing. And we gotta do our thing. And kill these ghosty guys. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna chain lightning them. We're doing it. Oh, bam! Okay, we're doing this. We're doing this. I'm not going to pop my Shamanistic Rage just yet. We might need to save it for, like, maybe a bigger wave later. And it looks like this guy does not uh, help us out. I'm going to pop a heal because we're getting low. And what the hell? is like a bunch of ghost guys here and shit. Just, like, swimming around and shit. It's kind of crazy. Alright. Uh, Vengeful Drain Eye. Please die. Uh... Okay, let me heal up. Oh my god, there's more, there's more. Oh, chill, 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 chill. We need to cl clear this guy now. Okay, yeah, there's more. Uh, I'm gonna kite him over here. Hopefully we can clear this guy fast. Oh shit. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, oh, what the? Wait, 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 why, why, why did he fall down? Wait, what? Wait, 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 did we just lose? Oh no. Oh no. Oh shit, wait. So if you, oh no. So he dies off one hit, oh shit, that guy. Man, I didn't know he was gonna be that freaking weak sauce, bro. What the fuck, man? Alright, I'm not doing this quest, guys. I'm not doing this quest. This shit is too... We can do it, like, maybe when we're, like, level 65 or something like that. But, 64... I think we're pushing it. Alright, so, whatever. It's fine. We don't even need to worry about that. Uh... Wait, what the fuck? Alright, so what I'm gonna do here is we're gonna kill this last Nethermancer here, and we're just gonna YOLO and run outside. Run all the way out this biatch and GTFO because I'm sick and tired of fighting these freaking toilet paper freaking mummy guys. Sick and tired of it. Oh, yo, chill, 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 guys. Relax. Can we all just relax here for one moment for me, please? And not kill me. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, yeah, we are gone. Okay, guys. Okay, oh, Alkendown is over here, though. Okay. Oh, wait, no, wait, wait, wait. This is... The whole thing is Alkendown. I thought I thought that was, like, maybe a dungeon or something. Is this whole thing called Alkendown? No, this whole thing is called the Ring of Observance. So, actually, yeah, this is where Alkendown is. All right, well, whatever. We freaking finished the freaking, uh... Quest, the Tomb of Lights quest. We didn't do the Vengeful Harbinger quest. Harbinger quest. I feel like we could have done it though. Uh, we just need to be a little bit stronger, I think. If we could um, burst those uh, Vengeful, Dreadful, whatever, Vengeful Drain Eye guys a little bit faster, I feel like we could definitely do that quest. But right now, I feel like we're a little bit too weak. We don't burst them down fast enough. Unfortunately, we do not. But it is fine, guys. It's fine. Uh, what else? What can we do, though, in today's video? It's 127. I probably want to leave around, like, 2.30. We can go to Vale Lithic, guys. Lithic these nuts. And we can also go to the Shadow Tomb. That would be pretty fun, guys. Alright, All right. So we can go to Vale Lithic. We can go to the Shadow Tomb. And just have ourselves a wonderful, great time, guys, you know? Oh shit, no, 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 leave me alone. I don't want to go that way. Alright, well, where is Vale Lithic? Let's go, let's, let's read the quest. Vale, now what the... <laughs> Sign up to win a trip to... What? Alright, fuck it. If it's from the Adidas, Adidas Yeezy confirmed app, I will sign up. Oh, something in the water music festival. Oh, I heard about this. 
Did I, I think one of my friends went to that. Um, went to the something in the water festival. I think. Uh, I forget though. Oh shit. Uh, actually, guys, let's fight. Uh, what's this guy's name? Uh, what's that big bird's name? Trakella, because we need his like uh, bones or something like that for uh, the other quest, Torgos. Trakella's carcass. Yeah, we need his bones. See, so let's kill Trakella. I have to. <coughs> I have to sneak. <coughs> oh gosh, excuse me. What the heck? Oh, we got the disease, right. Alright, Trakella. Oh, actually, well, let's fight this bone guy, because he's kind of in the way. You must be flagged for PvP in order to capture this objective. What objective? No, I don't even... So I'm reading what's in the quest dialogue. <laughs> oh, no, I want to sign up for this thing. Let me sign up for this thing. You're in. Congratulations, you're in the running for a weekend at something in the water. If I get a free weekend at a concert, I'm about to freaking go. I'm about to just go and just like, maybe just like, just vibe out for real. I mean, I love live music. Live music is awesome. I used to go to a good amount of show, guys. I haven't been to a show in a while. So that would be fun. That would be very fun. Alright, we gotta kill Trakella. We gotta kill Trakella for uh, a quest item. We need this little uh, his carcass here. And I'm gonna try to attempt Mr. Torgos here. Where do I go? I'm gonna try him. Hopefully he's not like an elite or nothing. Okay, yeah, we found Trakella, but... Oh shit, wait, we're about to die. What the fuck? I didn't even realize that. Alright, yeah, we need this carcass. Let me get this freaking disease off me, Jesus. Uh, okay, well, we have the carcass now. Uh, place the carcass at the base of the Archon Scarecrow known as... Torgos' Bane. You'll need his mate, Trakella's carcass, though. <laughs> Where is the... What? What's Scarecrow, bro? Where is Torgos' bane? Man, who the fuck is... Who is Torgos' bane? Man, and they don't even tell me the quest, bro. I gotta, like, find out for myself. What the hell? Call down Torgos at... Which oh, because of a of uh, uh, Torgos return it in the mall. Return it to a mall Grimshot. So hold... Hold on. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah, I think. We have to go to Veil Rays, I mean. Alright, so we have to, I think we'll... I think Torgos is at Veil Rays. Oh, let me get this freaking. I don't even know what was attacking me. Let me turn on this quest though. I mean, we're already here. We might as well just turn it in. The Tomb of Lights. Out here in the wilds of Outland, we are weak with few heroes uh, to defend our rights. But you have given them something to fear, Shaman. I do not think the Ethereals will soon forget the strong right arm of Hello B. Oh, that's not the only reason why they call me Strong Right Arm. Huh? Huh? Okay, I'm not gonna get into details though. I'm not gonna get. Oh, a quest opened up. Sue Levine. What, do you need, stranger? what up, I'm guy? This is just horrible. I care not for our own discomforts here, but we must do something to ease the pain of the dead and the bone waste. Recover the bones. Oh, yeah, and also, sorry guys, my camera, um, I put it on like the auto white focus feature. And that motherfucker was like changing my skin color like every like five seconds. It was so annoying. That was in my last video though. So hopefully my skin color isn't changing like every single time I move. Like I need to get a new camera, bro. This thing is this webcam. I'm not getting a webcam this time. I'm getting like an actual camera. Cause this webcam is some bullshit, dude. Excuse my language. And I also tried my best not to curse, guys. Usually I'd be cursing a lot when I talk, but I try not to curse because I don't think YouTube likes that. So. 
if you hear me like you know like catch myself saying something and I stop myself then you know that's probably why but anyways the bones of the dead drain I litter uh, the bone waste from the explosion of Alkendown their spirits are restless and cannot move on to the next life shaman you must help me to recover their bones and take them to their final resting place only then will they be at peace only then will they know comfort Gather up the restless bones with care and deliver them to Ram Ramdor the Mad at Alkendown. In the center of the bone waste, despite his name, he will know how to care for them. Collect ten restless bones, deliver them to the Ramdor the Mad just off the western side of the Ring of Observance in Alkendown, which is in the middle of the bone waste. Okay. Alright, uh, sure. We can do that. Is this like a group quest, maybe? No, it's not. The bone waste. The bones of the dead are litter the bone waste. So I, I guess it's just like with the oh it's these things oh okay so it's these things right here so we have to collect uh ten of them all right yeah it's not bad hopefully like a ghost doesn't pop up once we take these please okay nice it's just a normal set of bones this time around guys thank God because sometimes when you like pick certain items up like enemies spawn from them like like that for example but they didn't this time so that's very nice we have to go to veil vale rays so let's do that veil vale rays is like over here or something like that i believe yeah veil vale rays should be over there what the who's attacking me oh it's a freaking worm guy Dang worm guy. You must be flagged for PvP to capture this objective. Oh, what, what, what objective? Wait, is this Veil Rays? I swear to god, this is Veil Rays, right? I think. Maybe it's not. Yeah, we were here in the last video. This should be Veil Rays, right? Okay, maybe it's not. Wait, where are we? Oh shit! Huh, I'm gonna explore this. Cause what is this? Why can't? Why is this thing like not explored? Shadow tomb. All right, ow! Oh my god, those arcane missiles do a lot of damage, bro. No chill, homie. Are right, we gotta go to Veil? Wait, who the fuck? Torgos? Oh shit, it's Torgos. What the fuck? Can we fight him? We can't fight him. So Torgos is a level 65 elite monster. Okay. Um. All right. Let's. We gotta find Torgos's bane. Who the frick is Torgos's bane? I see Spirit Raven. I don't see Torgos' Bane, though. Maybe we gotta talk to Floon. Maybe he's gonna help us. Hopefully. Is this Torgos' Bane? I don't know. Screeching Spirit. Okay, this guy does not speak English. No, that's not Torgos' Bane, either. That definitely is not Torgos' Bane, huh? I need to get away from this Spirit Raven guy. This guy is... Come on, bro. Really? Come on, bro! What are you doing, Spirit Raven? Leave me alone, dude. Why are you, like, walking towards me like that, dude? Just freaking get away from me. I don't want you here. Okay, uh, we gotta find, like, a scarecrow or some shit, man. What in the world? What am I supposed to be doing? Is this a scarecrow? Oh, it's right here! Oh, I'm freaking blind. It's like this giant freaking scarecrow here. Completely missed it. Alright, well, you know what? We're just gonna full on YOLO and fight Mr. Torgos himself. 
Although these guys are pretty hard, these guys, so I mean, honestly, I feel like we're gonna get owned by him. But, um, you know what? I'm down to try, guys. I'm down to try. If we die, then we die. Alright. It's fine. It's no big deal. We got Torgos over here. Just vibing out. I want to kill this screeching spirit. Just in case. He, like, starts walking over towards me while we start fighting Torgos, you know. That would be very problematic, guys. So, okay. Um. We have someone here. A troll priest. I don't know if he's doing Torgos, though. So, you know what? It's just time to full-on YOLO. Let's do it. We're placing the Torgos' Bane down, and we got Torgos here, guys. Okay, I'm just gonna pop this. Yes, because he hurts very badly. Stamina reduced. Okay, come on, we can do this. I'm gonna pop a heal. I'm incapacitated. What? I'm gonna pop another heal. Let's resummon my- oh! I'm gonna get rid of his disease. We need to heal again. Our shamanistic rage wore off, so it's not good. Oh, we're incapacitated again. Okay. We couldn't stop the disease that time. We can do it now, though. I'm gonna heal again. Okay, I'm very scared. Oh my god, this guy hits like a truck. Oh shit. Yeah, he definitely hits like a truck. Oh, uh, we're doing it though, guys. We're doing it. Uh, oh my god. Oh, please, please, please. Oh no. Oh, oh my god. What was that? Wait, what was that? What? Dude, he just one shot us. Bro. Wait, what was that? Oh my god, dude. We were so close to killing him, man. We were so close. And then he pulls out a one shot ab ability. Oh, come on, man. Come on, man. Alright, well, you know what? It's fine, it's fine. I'm gonna attempt it one more time. And if we can't do it, if we can't beat him, then I'm just gonna say screw it. We're not gonna do this quest anymore. But we could, we could, I mean, we could kill him though, but he, he has that, like, he does a lot of damage in that, that one ability. I don't, I don't know what it's called though. I couldn't really get a good look at it, um, but wow, that that kind of hurt a lot. Not gonna lie, we we actually got one shot. It deals like maybe like two thousand damage because we were at like I want to say like a thousand seven hundred health. We were at that um, HP mark, but I couldn't really tell. I couldn't. Oh, we actually we can tell. Hold on, combat log. What happened to me? Torgo's melee swing hits Hello B for 1,328 damage. Okay, that's actually good to know. Um, and I'm reading the combat log, by the way. I'll show you guys. So, yeah. Um, oh god, so he does 1,000... Favorite disease hits Hello B for 121 nature, 64 overkill. So we got killed. We got uh, killed by a melee swing plus the fever disease. Oh shit. Okay, so that's good to know. We got some information. Uh, we're a bit far away, so I'm just gonna wait. I'm gonna edit to the part where we're freaking fighting Torgos, or where we're fighting Torgos again, because I gotta get the Trakello's uh, Trakello's uh, car uh, carcass again, which is gonna be annoying. Maybe I'll try to farm like two of them. I don't know. We just gotta make sure that we're above 2,000 life, really, because I mean, he's gonna hit us for 1,300, and then he's gonna keep hitting us more, so we wanna make sure we're, you know, higher than 1,300. For sure, for sure. Alright, guys, so we have to go back 
to Trakello. I was just gonna edit to the part where we already had Trakello's carcass and all that stuff, but I guess we got some things to do on the way, I guess. We gotta collect these bones, and I guess that could be... Well, actually, it's probably not gonna be very interesting to watch, but I'm just gonna include it anyways, because... This video is not gonna be that long anyways, so I guess we can just put some stuff in there, some random stuff. Uh, we can go for this guy's bones here. Hopefully we don't aggro these, uh, drain eye guys. Oh. Okay, can we do this really quickly? Oh no, we're gonna aggro him! This bastard! Oh no, we aggro- Whoa, 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 what the fuck? Yo, chill, homies. What the fuck? Why is this guy shooting so many missiles at me, bro? Oh my god, dude, what the hell? Bro, that was a freaking mistake, dude. Oh my god, we almost died again. I have to try not to die a lot because, I mean, the spawn is very far. Man, I got a freaking eye booger. I freaking not coming on my eyeball. Ah, damn. I'm gonna, I need to click this bone piece. We need this bone piece. I mean, we could definitely kill Torgos, though. He's definitely killable. He was so close to dying that fight, but oh my god, he got a crit off on me. Which sucks. He got a crit off on me, and we were at very low HP. I was really thinking of using the health potion, which I should have done, but I didn't do it. Unfortunately, so I guess now we know it's good if we had uh, I wish we had like scrolls something like scroll of stamina scroll of defense scroll of something That would be very nice. We have like stone skin totem to help us against the physical damage We have healing stream. We're using grace of air and then flame tongue. That's what that's the totem that we're using So I mean we're using everything that we can to defeat them as easy as possible, but Ugh. Excuse me, he still hits like a gosh dang truck. Alright, so we're here at Carry On Hill in the Boner Waste. And uh, there she is. There is Trakella. I'm sorry, Trakella, but it is time to die again. Is there a way we could just like hit him without aggroing this other bone lasher? Okay, well, never mind, we can't. We can't. Cannot do it. Get this freaking disease off me. Get your dirty germs off me. Okay. Come on, Trakella. Or, I mean, this is going to be the one. I thought, for some reason, I thought this was Torgos. I was like, this is going to be it. But wait, we're not even at Torgos yet. But we can do it this time, guys. I swear it. I freaking swear it, man. We can do it. I believe. Okay, I believe. In the cause. We can do this, guys. We can do this. We just need to make sure we're always above 2,000 life when fighting Mr. Torgos. Oh, man. His, his mate is very powerful. Jesus Christ. Well, that was with no totems, though, so... I mean... She's gonna have to see me with them totems up, though. Okay, guys. We have another carcass. Um... I guess we'll attempt it again, you know? I don't know if this is gonna go well. However... Um, you know, you only live once, aka YOLO. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do it, because fuck it, why not, right? Who cares? And if we die again, we die again, and then we just forget about it till we, you know, can get another level. Oh, it's these guys again. These guys look really cool. We saw them in the last video. Uh, if you guys didn't watch the last video, make sure you guys, uh, I highly suggest you guys watch that, because, you know, we're just having a lot of fun here, guys! Having a lot of fun here, playing some World of Warcraft. And actually, I'm thinking... I'm thinking I fight Torghost with a lightning shield, actually. I think. Who is this? Lost Spirit? Damn. Oh, there's more of them. Oh, shit. There's a lot of them, actually. Sheesh. 
So yeah, I'm thinking we fight Torgos with a um, lightning shield just so we can, you know, maybe, uh, burst him down maybe a little bit faster uh, before he can, you know, do the same to us. Oh no, this guy is gonna walk over here. Oh no. Oh my god, so many birds, bro. So many chickens. Oh my god, what the f Okay, no, I'm running. I'm running. Okay, no, actually, you know what? I'm not running. Screw this guy. I'm tired of getting bullied by these freaking bird people. Alright, it's time to get my revenge! I need to interrupt that. Get rid of this disease. Interrupt that. Yes. Yeah, this will teach you. This will teach you to mess with Hello B. That's right, you stupid bird people. Stealing the children. And then trying to steal the lives of others. You cold-hearted bastards! Okay. Enough molding over the birds, guys. Enough molding. Let's go fight Torgos again, aka let's get our cheeks clapped by this freaking bird again. It's gonna be fun, guys. Uh, we're gonna die probably again. Uh, I mean, you know, it is what it is, though. But if we do manage to beat him, that would be very nice. He's really strong, though, guys. So my ho my hopes aren't that high right now. You know, morale is kind of low. But I mean, there is a potential that we can defeat Mr. Torgos here. It is quite the possible possibility. All right. Because we were so close last time, guys, and we didn't pop any of our CDs. Or we, we didn't pop any of our uh, potions or anything. Excuse me, we did pop our CDs. We did pop our Shamanistic Rage. Uh, okay, so I'm going to set up my totems again. Hopefully we can do this. Here, take the carcass. Yes, sir. Uh, and like I said, I'm going to try the Lightning Shield tactic. And... There we go. Oh no, we, he missed. We missed. Fever disease. Okay, let's do that. Let's do that. I'm gonna make sure we heal. We gotta make sure that we're above. Uh, 2,000 life. I wanna get rid of this disease. Okay, he's dodging everything. That's not good. I just need to heal. I just need to heal here. Oh shit. Oh no, oh no. Okay, we could do this, we could do this. We we used our potion there, unfortunately. Oh shit. Wait, wait, wait. We need to heal. Okay, we we can do this. Can we? Oh no, we're gonna die, we're gonna die! No, he's so close to dying! No, he's at 19 life. No! Oh, no. Alright, guys. We tried it again. Alright, at least we could say that we tried it again. Alright. Valiantly, however, we did. We did again. Alright. So, aka, I'm not messing with that bird because... He hurts. Uh, we could probably definitely do it at like level 65, or if we like get some, uh, you know, stronger equipments. Although our equipments are pretty good, they're like not bad. Um, but yeah, we're probably gonna have to put that quest on hold. It was nice though. It was a good attempt though. We we almost <clears throat> we almost got him down that second time. He was at like 20 something percent life left. Oh my god! If we if we were just a little bit more stronger and tankier, we definitely could have done that. So that's why I'm probably gonna just like wait till we get another level. All right, whatever. Uh, well, it's fine though. What can we do though? We gotta get more of these bones. We gotta go to Vale Lithic. Where is Vale Lithic? Southwest, northeast, southwest. Okay, so it's probably over here in this undiscovered uh, area. So we can do that. It's 1.53. We have some time before uh, we go to work. So I'm going to try to get as much stuff in as possible. Um, so yeah, we're going to go to Vale Lithic next. We're probably going to go ahead and do those 
I'll finish the quest there. Uh, hatchlings redeem. Break the cursed eggs in Veolithic. Malevolent hatchling slain. Okay, so we have to break some eggs. Okay. Oh, wait, we get some, uh... New bracers. 218 armor, 13 agility, 19 stamina. Oh! Okay, so these actually are gonna help us- Oh, wow. Oh, we need this. We need this. Because we don't need the intellect. We need, uh, the, the stamina, which is gonna be very good. It's gonna make us tankier. Uh, which is very nice. I, I don't think it's enough to kill, um, Torgos. But, um, it's gonna be good for when we, uh, you know, continue doing the quest that we need to do here. Uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna put Torgos on hold, because this guy's freaking scary, man. I don't have time for that ish. Like, I literally don't have time. Like, I actually don't have time. Like, we have to go to work soon. We gotta go to work soon. We have to go to work. I want a church girl who go to church and reads her Bible. You guys know that meme? You guys remember that uh, v meme or vine or whatever? I think it was a vine. I think it was like, I want a church girl who go to church and read her Bible. You guys remember that one? You guys remember that one? Anyone? Anyone? Any remembers? Any I rememberers in the chat? Potentially, potentially. Alright, but anyways, enough embarrassing myself. Let's go to Vale. Oh, wow, look at that. Look at the little sunset there. It looks very neat. It looks very nice. Is this the Vale Skithith or Vale Lithic? Oh, what the? There's ogres here. What the fuck? Bleeding Hollow Ruins. Oh, what the? Oh, no wonder why it's orange, because it leads to Nagrand. Okay. Oh, and, there, and there's uh, uh, ogres here. That's why there are ogres here, because... In the grand, there are a lot of ogres. Alright, but we don't have to worry about the ogres for now. We gotta worry about these bird people. Um, so yeah, let's go over there and fight the bird people. What is this? Face burst? Alright, whatever. Oh, it looks like someone's here. We got a little moonkin guy, a little boomkin guy. Veil Lithic. So we gotta, uh... <laughs> Excuse me. Oh shit, I didn't realize that this guy was inside here. Alright, whatever, we're fighting. So we gotta uh we gotta find like some eggs or something like that. I don't I don't know what um what what the eggs are or what they look like, but we gotta find some eggs and we gotta break the eggs. Um so I'm keeping my eyes peeled for some eggs. Not seeing any. Oh, we got feathers though. Uh, where are the eggs though? Like, I'm assuming <clears throat> they should just be like scattered around. So let's just explore. Let's do a little Dora the Exploring. Oh shit, we're about to die. Hold up. <coughs> <coughs> Okay, uh, we got a guy here. Is this guy? No. Uh, we need to find... I need to find the eggs. Where are the eggs? I don't even know, like, what I'm supposed to be... Oh! Oh! We found the egg! Oh, here we go. Oh, they're in, like, these little nest things. Alright, so we gotta destroy... Eggs here. Oh, no! Wait, wait, wait. What the fuck? Okay, alright, well, we, we redeemed the hatchling. So we have to uh, redeem three hatchlings, and we have to slay three malevolent hatchlings. And it says, the redeemed hatchling flies up through the trees free of Terox corruption. Nice, guys, nice. We're doing things. You know, I feel like we're doing things that are important, guys, that are really helping out the world of Warcraft. So it's always good guys, it's always good to be, you know, a nice person, help out the people and the citizens. You know, just be an overall good guy. It's always good. And I highly suggest you guys transfer that energy into the real world. People would appreciate you. Oh, we got Malevolent Hatching here. Die, you freaking <clears throat> evil bird. This thing's about to grow to be one of these freaking bird men, evil bird guys things, so we gotta definitely 
No, I definitely own this guy. Get out of here. Alright, cool. Alright, and this guy isn't- a, it's not- he's not an egg, but... I'm gonna fight him anyways, because we need... Feathers. We just need six more feathers, because we need to get the rare item from this uh, the, this quest here. Because it's gonna definitely help us. Oh, it, it might even help us kill Torgos, even. So, I mean... You know, you already know I, I'm gonna go above and beyond to do that. Because I love this game, and I love playing video games in general, and I have no life. That's why I have the time to do that, so... Yes, guys, that's a little bit about me. Hopefully you guys like me. Oh, we got another malevolent guy. Alright, um... Boom. Level and hatching is kind of kind of tough. Okay, I'm gonna go inside and find this bird guy. Okay. Oh, big damage there. Very large damage. Copious amounts of damage. Cool. Okay. No feathers. It's fine. It's fine. Let's go ahead and see if this guy will drop. Oh, no, we can fight this guy. Yeah. This guy is next to an egg as well, so it's even better. It's even better. Oh, what the? Hold on, let me heal up real quick. This guy just freaking ganked my ass. What is this? Piercing armor. Oh, shit. So we gotta burst him fast. We gotta burst him down fast, boys. Wait, did we get a feather from that? Oh, no, we didn't. I don't think. Alright, give me a feather. Ooh, we got two. Heck yeah. Uh. Oh, God, excuse me. It was a little bit nasty of me there. Sorry, guys. It had to come out, though. It has to come out, alright? It's all it's natural, alright? It's all natural. It's just a burp. But it, but it had to come out. I'm not holding that itch. I'm not holding that itch in. Coming out, guys. <clears throat> Just like when I have to fart, it's coming out, boys. It's coming out. Uh, okay, uh, enough embarrassing myself. Uh, we need to find some more eggs. So we gotta look for like the nest things. I don't think there are any nests over here. Yeah, I'm hovering my mouse over, trying to find like the cog wheel. Ooh, a feather. Oh, okay, here we go. We got one right here. Perfect. Alright, so we just need one of each. We just need one uh, malevolent, and then we need to just need we need one more uh, to redeem. Oh, nice. We got the redeemed one. That's cool. Alright, yeah, we can fight you. I'm gonna chill here for a little bit. Um, well, what the heck? Why is that Kodo so small? Yeah, but I'm gonna chill here for a little bit. Ow! What the? Man, this, what the? Wait, why did this guy uh, come attack me? Like that. That's crazy. He like freaking swooped on my ass. God damn. Alright, yeah, so we just need one more egg. One more, guys. Uh, we need the malevolent one this time, though. We need the malevolent one. Uh, we just took an egg from there, so it's probably. Oh, we got. Oh, we got the egg right here. Uh, it could be a redeemed one, though, so... I don't want to keep my hopes too high. I don't want to keep my hopes too high. Oh! Do we have enough? Oh my god, we just need one more feather? Freaking... Freaking A, man! Come on, man. Give me a malevolent. No, I don't want a redeemed guy. We already have enough redeemed guys. I'm looking for your evil twin brother. Oh, this one might be it. This one might be it, guys. And it is! Die, you freaking hatchling. Die, I tell you. Alright, let's go. Boom. 
Does this guy have like a Nogan Fogger elixir? He doesn't. So that's just how the undeads. That's how the toad. That's how the torrents look with the undeads. <clears throat> it's very small. I don't like it. I like the torn mount because it's big. Uh, okay. So now, what is this? The shadow tomb? Going to the shadow tomb? Gotta, oh, wait, wait, what am I doing? Wait, wait, no, no, no. Wait, who's attacking me? Oh, this guy. Yeah, we need one more uh, Araquah feather. So, yeah, we need to go do. I need to farm that really quickly, guys. I thought we were done here, but we're not. <clears throat> Uh, are we gonna be done to here though after you mr. Oracle cuz are you going to Drop me a feather gosh dang it He didn't drop me the dang feather All right, whatever Surely mr. Oracle here will I believe I believe all right moment of truth. Oh Okay, well, it's fine. It's fine Well, who is this mug ock? What? Who is this guy? Come out, little. Let me read what he Let me read what he's saying. Come out, little birdies. Mugok want to play. No hurt Mugok's feelings, Birdman. Fine, birdies be that way. Mugok, find new friends. Who the hell is this? What is that ogre doing here? It's weird. Did someone activate that? I, I'm not sure why he's there. Is that just a random spawn? I don't know. But alright guys, we actually found the, the last feather, so that's good. Alright, so now we can go back to the bone waste. We have to go to the shadow tomb. Also. Um, I think, wait, how long have I been recording for? I've been recording for about hour 10. Eh, that's fine, we could do the shadow tomb. Hopefully it's not very difficult. It doesn't say that we need like a group or nothing, so I'm assuming that it's gonna be fairly uh, easy, hopefully. Cause yeah, that's all we have to do now. Cause the other two quests that we have, those are the group quests, and yeah, that's pretty much it. We completed all the other ones too. Oh, uh, we oh we also need to do the restless bone quest. But I mean, that's gonna be very easy. Like literally, you just this one right here. So we just need one more of the restless boners right over here. Restless boners. Kick, 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 kick. Okay, uh, what? Okay, we gotta go to Shadow Tomb, right? Shadow Tomb. So we have to get a uh, Drape of Arunen, Gavel of Kalan, and Scroll of Atalor. Bro, who name? I mean, who are these guys' parents, bro? Who are these guys' parents naming their kids these things, bro? They're gonna get made fun of in school and shit. You name your kid Arunen, Kalen, and Atalor? Now, come on, bro. You gotta get with the times, alright? We're not a freaking 1700 anymore. You can't name your kid freaking Cornelius Xavier freaking Robinson. Can't do that ish anymore, alright? You gotta name him like Bob Joe. Alright, or, or else he's gonna get made fun of at school. Man, what the? Alright, freaking, you're just gonna die. I'm, I'm sick of you shooting your dang freaking arcane bullshit at me. It's so annoying. Just die! Die, you mother effer. Alright, yeah, these guys aren't so bad. These guys aren't so bad. I'm just gonna pop a big heal in front of his face, disrespectfully. Okay, we're good. Oh no, get away from me, you freaking ghost bird. I'm getting tired of you freaking dealing with birds and shit. It's so annoying. It's so annoying. We don't want to collect those because we are not with the Aldors. We are with the Scryers. Okay, so yeah, we, this is the Shadow Tomb, boys. We have to enter into the Shadow Tomb. And we have to steal articles of clothing from people and like a gavel and a scroll. Um, I guess, you know. So yeah, we're just stealing powerful- sorry, I was just reading the quest. We're basically just stealing powerful artifacts from the Cabals. Because we don't want- uh, we don't want it to be in their hands. Because, I mean, these guys are evil people. 
they're the evil ones. Wait, what did it say again? They are using the Shadow Tomb to store powerful artifacts from Alkendown. Three of these are sacred, for they belong to the powerful patriarchs of Arunin. Yeah, okay. Alright, let's go ahead and fight you. Uh, Cabal is a uh, Cabal Abjurist. Uh, where is... I I'm assuming... Oh, what the? Someone gives a quest in here. Akuno. Oh, what the fuck? What in the hell was that? Okay, we need to just burst him down. We need to just start killing one of these guys. Because these guys are very annoying. Oh my god, this fucking... Dude, this guy is so annoying, bro. I hate these freaking... The mages, dude. <clears throat> freaking shooting the freaking arcane missiles. Dude, shooting like 10 arcane missiles at me, bro. Like, golly. Man, needs to chill. Freaking sucker. You little... Biatch. Alright, uh, we're good here. So, uh, we gotta find a drape, we gotta find a gavel, and a scroll. I do see- oh. Okay. I thought I saw a scroll over there, but we can't really interact with it, so... Looks like that's not it. What is this, a poison? Movement speed? It's not bad. Uh, okay. Cabal Tomb Raider. Please die, thank you. Alright, this guy is gonna cast his little, uh, stupid arcane missiles. I'm gonna interrupt you. I'm here. Oh, he's casting it again! I don't know how he's casting it again, but... I guess. Uh, is there even anything on this side? Like, am I even supposed to be here? Oh shit, okay, uh, actually I'm gonna summon my totems here. Yeah, we're, we're okay, we're okay. We are okay. Everything is going swimmingly. Everything's fine, guys. Everything's fine. Let's go ahead and kill this other skirmisher here. Pick up our loot skis. And then we can go fight this guy. He's gonna be pretty cool to fight, right, guys? Actually, we've already been fighting him. Oh, okay, there's a Cabal chest right here, so... Alright, so it's probably what we need. So okay, we we did go to the right area, I'm assuming. <clears throat> Alright, yes. Let me open this box here. And what do we have here? We got the gavel of Kalen. Okay. Wait, what items am I not picking up from these guys? Oh the marks, right. Okay, so I'm assuming, you know, another piece is on this side. Uh, yeah, we got the box right there. So I'm gonna just try to do this as quickly as possible, because we do have to go to work soon. We have to get ready for work. I still haven't, like, brushed my teeth in ish. So my breath is kind of stinky. Uh, I'm gonna actually pull this guy, too. We're just gonna get both these guys cleared out the way. If I could freaking cast... This dude would stop freaking smacking me in the face with his freaking swords. Okay, come on, just die. Just die, there we go. Okay, now we move on to Mr. Tomb Raider. Mr. Tomb Raider. Big damn. Very large amount of damn. Good job, Hello B. Good job, Hello B. Oh, we're actually out of mana. Wow. We haven't had to use a mana potion in a while because of our um, water shield. Our water, the water shield is so good for just like, you know, just to keep on going. You know, you don't have to freaking every single fight. After every single fight, you have to freaking like, you don't have to drink water in ish, which is very nice. Water shield is a lifesaver for show. Oh, he doesn't cast the missiles? Oh, there it is. There it is. See ya. Who oh, is this? A Tomb Raider and a Skirmisher? Alright, it's fine. 
Oh no, this guy probably needs it too. This guy probably needs the, uh, thing. Right, I'm gonna take it. I'm taking it. I'm taking it, warrior. Alright, I'm just gonna take it. I'm just gonna take it. I'm sorry, warrior. I'm gonna take the drapes. Oh, it doesn't disappear. Oh, I thought it disappeared after, so... That's why I was kind of hesitant on uh, taking it. You know, because with these things, you don't want to be BM. It's just like, dude, everyone's trying to everyone's trying to make it. Everyone's trying to grind. You know, like, you just want to be nice, you know? Like, there's no point in, like, being a freaking a-hole about it. You know? You know, so that's why I waited to let him go first, you know? I waited for the Alliance of Brethren. But yeah, thankfully, uh, it's not one of those things that goes away. So that's actually, that's good. Alright, so we are entering into the main area here. And who is this? Oh, oh shit. Oh, what the? Whoa, 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 what the? Yo, 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 I'm not ready for you. I'm not ready for you. Hold on. Cabal Interrogator. Ruin finds us all. Okay. Man, this guy attacks a lot, bro. Can you stop attacking so fast, bro? Ali. Guy's freaking freaking swailing on me right now. Can you chill, my guy? Can you relax? Excellent. Oh, what the? Someone give me a buff. All right, Akuno, what are you? Oh! Oh, oh wow, these guys are just clearing this stuff out. Who the fuck is this? Hathias the Wicked? God damn. We need to find the scroll. Of of something scroll of Alatator Altalador. We need to find that. So it's probably I'm assuming over here. This guy looks really badass though. Not gonna lie. Oh, it's right here. All right. Hopefully we can just yoink this chest without pulling the aggro on that this big scary lady. Very nice. We did it. Alright, so we got the scroll. Oh, and here we go. We're doing it, guys. Alright, whatever. I'm just gonna go ahead and do this escort quest, because fuck it. It's mine. It's mine! The XP is mine. Alright, we'll join this guy's group here. Oh, this guy's fighting the little mini boss guy. Die, you freaking wicked witch. So how does escort quest work when you are in a party? I don't know. Oh. Oh, okay, that's how it works. Alright, well, I guess that's pretty nice. Let us leave this place. I've had enough of these madmen. Oh, we couldn't get to read it, though, but I, mean, I guess it's fine. Die, you freaking cabalist. Oh, what the? This guy just popped up out of nowhere, bro. Wait, this guy's a warrior and he's dual wielding one-handed? He must be Fury. And he's just like getting ready. Yeah, he is Fury. Wait, and he's using the, um... Wait. Wait, what the? Oh, shit, dude. Wait, I thought um, Fury Warriors had Titan's Grip. Did, Ti did Titan's Grip not get introduced until Wrath of the Lich King? Oh my god, so Fury Warriors suck, bro. Holy crap. Oh, he resisted. What the? 
Wow, yeah, Fury Warrior system. Man, that guy was using- he, they can't even use two, uh, two two-handers in each hand. That's so... That's, uh, that sucks. Alright, well, Akuno... We're following you, buddy. Oh, what the? I shall be rewarded. Yeah, rewarded. With a freaking axe to the face. My axe. You bozo. Get out of here. Get out of here, you freaking bozo. So we have a uh, Blood Elf Priest. I actually kind of like the Blood Elves. I kind of want to make a Blood Elf character, but... I don't really know. I, I already, uh, I'm already... I've already committed to my Night Elf Druid. So, I mean... Oh man. Oh my god, we have the prayer of fortitude. We might be able no, you know what? I'm not even gonna risk it. I'm not even gonna risk it. I was about to say we could fight Torghost, but you know what? I'm not gonna do it. Beware! More cultists come. Okay. Oh wow, Akuno kinda owns. This man casted the chain lightning. Oh shit. Wait, I need to heal this guy. Oh wait, we can't even heal him. What the fuck? Oh man, my man's booking it now. What the hell? He's running. Oh shit. Damn, yeah, Okuno owns. Damn. Yo, he just did a chain lining and brought him from like 100% to freaking zero, dude. The fuck? That guy is freaking crazy, bro. Let's see his damage. Damn! Where do you go? What? Oh, okay, we're done. Alright, well, we're done. GG's. Thank you for PT. GG's, thank you for the PT. Incompetency. Alright, we done. Alright, it's like about 2.30. This is a great time to end the video. That was cool though, guys. That was nice. That was very nice. Oh, and if we log off now, we'll get our... We'll keep this buff. Oh my god, less an hour? Wow. Alright, this is uh, very nice though. Veil with thick, preemptive strike. It is grim work. Toiling with someone's hatchlings, yet ignoring the brewing evil would be a bleak proposition as well. You have done well. A uh, doll's favor shines upon your heart. And yes, boys, we get some new bracers. These are definitely going to help us out a lot. Gives us a new quest. There's some more veils. Wow. Veil Shalas signal fires. Terox perch. Skedis looms. Esketit looms over uh, above the bone waste to the east. At the base of Skedis, Esketit, excuse me, uh, shout out to Little Pump. At the base of Esketit lies Veil vale Shalas, wait, what? Uh, Terox Perch uh, looms above the bone waste to the east, okay. The most formidable, uh, formidable, oh wait, the, at the base of Skedis lies Veil vale Shalas, the most formidable of Terox colonies. It is through the stronghold of Veil vale Shalas that Terox Forward stages wage war against the light. Okay, so it looks like the bird people are trying to fight the Adal guys, I think, maybe. The evildoers of Shalas communicate. Who's Shalas? Oh, the Veil Shalas. Communicate with their master using a complex system of magical signifiers. Shout out to the East Orc and extinguish the fires. Once Veil Shalas is silenced, we can begin to plot the fall of Esketit. But I, I get ahead of myself. Kirik at the refugee caravan wants you to extinguish the four signal fires of Vale Shalas. And we get a cape, which is a healing cape. Don't really need that. Oh, we get a uh, cape for us, but eh, we lose agility and we lose stamina. So I think the cape that we have is better. And we <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> we also have a ring. Alright, whatever. I'm just gonna accept the quest. Alright, uh, let's go talk to some other dude. Wait, let me go ahead and sell this thing. We gotta sell... These pants, I guess? I mean, I don't really think we're gonna be auction housing them, right? Alright, let's equip our new, um... 
bracers here. Okay, not bad. Okay, let's go talk to Makeda here. Uh, the Shadow Tomb. Have you retrieved the relics, Hello B? We cannot allow the Shadow Council to use their power for dark purposes. I did have, I do have the um, relics. The light might have forgotten me, but I have not forgotten the light. These relics were once very sacred to my people, allowing the Shadow Council to use their power for evil is unthinkable. Okay, guy. Alright, we get it, we get it. Alright, well, well, we're obviously taking this ring here. Obviously. Okay, uh, escaping the mana tomb. This is the, um, uh, escort quest. So we have, uh, Kuno's Blade. Which, um, kind of stinks. Let's see what it looks like, though. And it looks like it stinks as well. We got a shield. We have an offhand, and we have another offhand. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the shield, because it's probably going to sell for the most. Uh, and then what are these Restless Bones quests? Uh, okay, we have to go to Alkendown. Uh, we got to go to Alkendown, right? Yeah, let's sell the shield. I guess we'll sell the glory before we do. Uh, let's equip this new ring that we have. So let's equip it for this. So 267, 360, 270, 363. Very nice. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and turn this bone waste, the Restless Bones quest. Uh, it says that uh, we gotta go to the west side of the Observant, of the Ring of Observance. So we gotta keep our eyes peeled for a question mark on the mini map. Probably like he's probably like somewhere over here. Maybe I Don't know where he is. This is like my first time ever coming inside this place It's pretty cool. Oh skeleton. Wow, that looks really cool. Oh my god, dude I can't tell direction again, dude. We're on the east side, bro. Oh my god, bro Dude, I cannot you cannot I cannot make this shit up, bro. I'm literally like so dumb. Holy it says I'll go to the west side on that. Oh, the east side, dude. What the hell? Bro. Now I got like... I don't even know what's wrong with me, bro. There's nothing wrong with me, alright? I'm fine. It's just... God dang it. I'm pulling a Zoro right now. If you guys watch One Piece, this man Zoro never knows where the fuck he's going, man. This man... Someone could tell him go straight, left, and right, and he will go like left, right, and straight. And then he'll be like, what's wrong? Like, freaking... Freaking, uh, what's his face? Freaking, I just pulled a Zoro just now. God damn. God damn, what's going on right now? Who are these guys? Alkani initiates? Alkani grounds? Man, that's embarrassing. Slain Alkani warrior, all oh, these are our homies. We gotta help them. Uh, they got some ghost guys here. God damn, can't y'all just go to the freaking... Can't y'all just go to heaven already? Like, why y'all still here? Alright, uh, who am I supposed to be talking to? Who the- where the frick is this guy? Oh, we're on the west side now, right? North, east, south, west. Oh, okay, he's right here. Okay! Oh, we have another quest here, as well. What the fuck is happening here? Alright, I'm not even gonna worry about that. That's their issue. That they have, That's a them problem. That is not a me problem. Uh, I don't know how to get inside. Um, we have to like go like underground or something like that. Maybe... Oh, nope. I don't want to aggro that guy. Is there an entrance over here, maybe, potentially? It looks like there isn't. What the heck? What is that? Like, these things are like shooting lightning bolts at these guys. Like, I don't even know what's happening, bro. Oh, okay. I think we go here, right? Yeah, we go here. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, guys. Just get attracted to my stone claw. Thank you. All right. Okay, so we're in Alkendown. So apparently there was a big explosion here of magic, of mana. 
that destroyed the place. And as you guys can see, we just did a little walk around of the area, and the place is clearly destroyed. So yeah, it's not good. It's not good. Uh, okay, and I think it has something to do with like those uh, toilet paper mummy guys, maybe potentially. Uh, I don't really know. Uh, wait, are we in the wrong area? Wait, where are we supposed to go, bro? Man, I'm wasting my time. I gotta go to work and shit. I gotta get ready and shit. Man, where are we going, bro? What is this place? Oh, okay, wait, we have to go here. Oh, whoa, look at this. There's a dungeon here. Oh, okay, it's just like right outside the dungeon. Alright, hey, what's up, guys? There's a little child giving me a quest. I see dead drain eye. Sheesh. I see Dead Drain Eye. This is a uh, obvious reference to The Sixth Sense, if you guys know what that movie is. Where the little kid is like, I see dead people and type, type shit. So yeah, that's this is an obvious reference. They're all around us. Bah, nobody believes me because I'm a child. Not even my own mommy believes me. Halei points at Ra uh, to Ramdor. He believes me though. Uh, though... What the... Wait, what the... Why is this guy talking to me? He believes me though. Halei tugs on... Mommy, grandfather says everything will be open. What is that? I need to stop getting distracted. He believes me though. He sees them too. Boy, does he get angry about it. It's kind of funny. I see ghosts and people just smile and pat me on the head, trying to placate me. Ramdor sees ghosts and people label him as crazy. I sure hope I never grow up. You should probably talk to Ramdor before you go inside. He was once a death priest. I want to say, uh, Clarissa wipes away the tears, wipes the tears away. Mommy won't let anyone harm you, sweetheart. Okay. Alright, Ramdor the Mad. I see dead drain eye. The child is correct. I was once a death priest. Ramdor winces. Such an unsavory- Man, what the- Why are you moving, bro? I'm trying to talk to you. Such an unsavory title. Though the corridor lies the- uh, Though that corridor lies the Alcani Cribs. Inside you will find the remnants of my priory. They are all mad now, of course. Insane to the last. I suppose I stood out, being the last one among them, with any common sense. Of course, I was excommunicated for my beliefs. What are my beliefs, you say? Oh my god, stop moving! God damn. Ezekiel, I believe that the dead, which we have been carrying for these last 500 odd years, should be left alone. Maladar has other- Oh my god. Maladar has other plans. He has retreated to the Crypt of Remembrance to start his experiments. Necromancy. I hope you weren't thinking about going in there. Not before helping me out, uh, not, not before helping me out so that these damn spirits will finally leave me alone. I know where they keep their treasures, Orc. Got your attention, eh? Bring me the Book of the Dead held by the Aldor Ezekiel of Shatrath. Find and speak with Ezekiel of Shatrath in Shatrath City. Okay. What's this? Who are you? Take some bones, man. I don't know. Just They told me to give them to you. Great, just what I needed. More bones. Ramdor size. Yes, yes, I will see to it that these remains of our honor- Oh yeah, we have to, uh, send these guys to, um, you know, let their spirits go to rest. They have a proper burial and shit. I will see to it that these remains of our honored ancestors are given a proper burial. Have no fear. There is something else that you can do if you're truly interested in aiding the dead. Helping the lost find their way. Many spirits of the Draenei were corrupted by the explosion of Alkendown. Now they wander the waste and torment. Hello B, I beseech you to put them to rest. Destroy the lost spirits and broken skeletons that haunt the bone waste beyond Alkendown's walls. What? You think leaving them to wander in blind agony would be better? Afterward, return to Solavine at the refugee caravan and tell him of that which you have done. Okay, oh. Oh. Wait, where did I get these boots? Uh, okay, whatever. Alright, we'll accept this quest. Man, this guy keeps on moving and stuff, freaking canceling out the freaking quest for me. I was like, God, golly. Alright, uh, what am I doing again? I think I'm done, right? Oh, uh, I have to do. Wait, what am I doing again? Oh, right, okay, I know what I'm doing. Okay. Alright, screw this place. I'm gonna astral recall. Back to Shatra. I say we got one more thing to complete before we end today's video, boys. And that is to turn these feathers. I forgot for a second that we had one more thing to do. I was like, wait one moment there. We got something to do. Oh, we can check our mail too, guys. 
But let's go ahead and just go to the lower city first. Let's go to the lower city, turn in these little feather quests, and hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, we can get the blue... Uh, I believe he gives us blue boots, I think? If I remember correctly. It's either that or, like, blue cape or something like that. I, I, I don't remember. Oh, it's Ezekiel. He's right here, actually. Oh, he's just chilling. He's just walking around. Oh, we could, we could, uh, we could talk to Ezekiel. Book of the Dead? Never heard of it. What's this about, anyway? Who sent you? What book? I don't see any book. Ramdor? Hmm, let me think. Ramdor. Oh, yes, the Death Priest. What does he want with the book? Well, it doesn't matter. Yes, I lied to you, and no, I don't have the book. Not anymore, anyway. It was stolen, probably by one of those filthy refugees. Besides, Alkendown is now defunct. We have no use for the book. If you find it, you can keep it. Like I said, well, what the, this guy just run? What is this guy doing? He's just running. Like I said, I saw uh, some of those ruffians snooping around the terrace last week. Start your search with them. They're probably playing dice in the slums. Ezekiel said the book has been stolen. Your best bet is to find the ruffians and see if they have the information. Okay. Dude, what is this shadow bug? Why am I getting like a shadow bug? Yo, Blizzard, can you fix your game? Like, what the hell? I've tried so many things to fix this shadow bug. Nothing has worked. Like, I, I, I don't know. Alright, whatever. Let's go uh, talk to the bird guy again. At least these guys are nice to us. They don't, they're not trying to freaking kill us in ish. So, I mean, I guess that's pretty good. Alright guys, let's go ahead and talk to Mr. Wait, what the? Where'd he go? Oh, he's right here. Alright, Vecax. Please, fingers crossed, give me your blue item. Give me- Oh no, I think it's a belt. I think he gives blue belt. Okay, here it is guys. Outcast Cash. Alright, Mr. Cash. I know. Past two times I opened you. You gave me a blue item the first time, but it wasn't for what I needed. And the second time you gave me a green item. I know this time around, and I'm so, this is my sweet talking, guys. I'm sweet talking, guys. If you guys don't know what I'm doing, I'm sweet talking, okay? It's happening, alright? If you think it's weird, I don't care. I'm doing it anyways. Okay, I'm continuing, continuing where I left off. Please drop me the mail. Belt for Enhancement Shaman, not for Elemental. Okay. For Enhancement Shaman. Please, please. Alright, we're gonna open it in three, two, one. Gosh dang it, a green cloth belt. You stupid bird! Where are you? You stupid bird, man. I freaking. I despise you. Looking over, looking there, all freaking innocent, acting like you didn't give me a piece of crap item. I guess we could sell it in the auction house. I guess. All right, guys, that is going to be the end of the video. I'm a little bit sad, like this silver wing emissary in the background crying. Because we got a freaking green belt again. This is our second green belt. Gosh, freaking dang it. I don't think I'm going to do the quest anymore. Unless, like, we somehow stumble upon a lot of feathers at once. So, I, I doubt that. Because I think we're pretty much done doing the Birdman quest. I think we have, like, one more Birdman quest. So, we'll see how many feathers we can get from them. But, I, I don't know. I'm not feeling so good on the uh, luck aspect of that out outcast cash thing. It, it's been kind of screwing me over. Um, but yeah, guys, that's going to be the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. I would appreciate that a lot. It helps me out. It's going to help me grow and help me make some of that YouTube money so I can buy a better... Uh, buy better equipment and don't you guys want that don't you guys want that for me all right hopefully hopefully you guys do uh but yeah guys uh today's video what did we do we just uh trained at the bone waste uh we did a cool little uh, escort quest someone helped us out 
we actually had a little bit of interaction in today's video. We had a couple of people uh, questing inside the Shadow Tomb as well. There was an Alliance and a Horde. Uh, both of them seemed pretty chill. Uh, we helped out the Alliance guy. The Alliance guy helped us kill some things. Uh, we failed miserably fighting Torgos. Um, well, not miserably. We actually got him down to a pretty good amount of health. So um, it, was a va it was a valiant effort, but we, alas, we failed. It's all good, though. Uh, we're probably going to... Uh, fight him when we're like level 65 maybe um, or if I get enough items with enough stamina and like defense maybe But um, yeah guys you can expect that in the next video We're gonna continue the quest here in Terra car forest and more specifically the bone waste I'm gonna finish all the quests here and then guys guys We're doing it. We're gonna go back guys Where we're gonna go back you might say you might ask We're going back to freaking Zanger Marsh Slam's desk, Sanger Marsh, one of my favorite zones ever. Honestly, guys, I think it beats Hellfire Peninsula. Um, the only thing that I have against um, Zanger Marsh is that it. I think it's a little bit smaller than Hellfire Peninsula. I think. So here, yeah, we have Zanger Marsh here, and then we have Hellfire here. Hellfire seems a little bit bigger. Zanger Marsh could be. It could be like a very similar. These get these. These look very similar in size, but I don't know. Zanger Marsh seems a little bit smaller to me. I could be tripping though, but whatever. That's irrelevant. But anyways, we're gonna go back to Zanger Marsh, guys. Doing a vibe out with my spoiling homies. It's gonna be, just be a great time. So you guys are just gonna have to stay tuned for that. Uh, you guys gotta subscribe to the channel so you guys know when those videos are gonna get uploaded. I don't know if I have like the bell icon thing yet. I don't know if I have it. But if there is one there, you guys wanna make sure you hit that bell icon so you guys know when the next video is getting uploaded. So yeah guys, just a bunch of great stuff happening, uh, going to happen in the near future, so you guys want to make sure you're subscribed for that. I think that's going to be it for me today though. So I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.